So our next question, um, you know, voter turnout is something that has greatly hindered our democracy, specifically among young people. But the Bernie, the Bernie campaign did a great job of this, and you know, many young people such as myself were mobilized, but there's still a long way to go. So, you know, what do you feel needs to happen in order to get young people much more involved? Yeah, so the question of young people, you know, the Bernie campaign was uh, fueled certainly uh, by young people. I mean, it was interesting in state after state, we would go into a state and do polling, and he was w winning overwhelmingly with millennial voters. And then as he campaigned in the state, we did advertising and organizing, you would watch in the polling that his support would go up the age band, right? It would be like the millennials, and it would go to the 30 to 35, so the 30, it was almost like a thermometer. It was like this in every state. And if we could get high enough up the age band, we would win in the state, and if we couldn't get high enough, we, we, you know, we would not be successful. Um, and you know, the truth of the matter is, is the number of young people in this country, if they could dominate politics in the United States of America, they would register to vote and get out and vote. That's just a, a, I mean, that's just a demographic fact. Um, now, motivating young people to do that, that's a whole other uh, question. And I, you know, I do think it has helped to have candidates who are unabashedly progressive. Uh, who uh, don't take ten sides of every issue, uh, but you, you know the coalition that has nominated Andrew Gillum to be governor, the Democratic nominee for governor in Florida, clearly had a huge component of young people. That I, 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 the exact statistic escapes me, but the number of people who uh, voted for him who had not voted in the last three Democratic primaries in Florida is huge, uh, which means it was either young people or people who had checked out of politics who checked back in to vote for uh, Andrew Gillum. So uh, it is. Uh, Incredibly important that young people get involved and participate. Uh, and you know, I, we were in a little meeting before this, and uh, the truth of the matter is that it puts a lot of burden on other young people because uh, the the most persuasive voices to get young people to participate are other young people. Uh, that are listen to me, uh, frankly. Uh, my kids don't. I don't know why anybody else other young people would. <laughs> um, but you know, so young people who are are active and engaged, you know, have to get their friends involved. And I know sometimes there's a lot of pushback from people who uh, don't see the value in it, but your generation really can control things. I really don't believe that you're the leaders of tomorrow. You can really be the leaders of today. So thank you. Thank you so much.